Alright there guys, my name's Bowsy and today I'm going to tell you the 20 worst jokes ever in the world. Ever. Right, the first one is, two antennas met the roof, fell in love and got married. The ceremonies wasn't much, but the reception was excellent. Second one, a jumper cable walks into a bar, the bartender says I'll serve you, but I don't want to start anything. Third one, two peanuts walk into a bar and one was assaulted. Fourth one, a dyslexic man walks into a bra. Fifth one, a man walks into a bar with a slab of asphalt under his arm and says, a beer please and one for the road. Sixth one, two cannibals are eating a clown, one says you are, does this taste funny to you? Seventh one, Doc, I can't stop singing the green green grass of home, that sounds like Tom Jones syndrome, is it well, is it common well? It's not unusual. Ah, oh, it's not unusual. Here's one. Two cows are standing next to each other in a field. Daisy says to Dolly, I was artificially inseminated this morning. I don't believe you, says Dolly. It's true. No bull. Ninth one. An invisible man marries an invisible woman. The kids were nothing to look at either. Ninth one. Deja vu. The feeling that you've heard this bull before. What the fuck is this? Eleventh one. I went to buy some camouflage trousers the other day, but I couldn't find any. Twelfth one. A man woke up in the hospital after a serious accident. He shouted, "Doctor, doctor! I can't feel my legs." The doctor replied, "I know. I, I know you can't. I've cut off your arms." Thirteenth one. I went to a seafood disco last week and pulled a muscle. The muscle spelled M U S S E L. Fourteenth one. What you? Oh, for fuck's sake! This is like the oldest joke ever. What do you call a fish with no eyes? A fish. Two fish swam into a concrete wall, one turns to the other and says, Damn. Sixteenth one. Two Eskimos sit in a kayak with chili. They let a fire on the craft. Unsurprisingly, it's sank proving once again that you can't have your kayak and heat it too. Seventeenth one. A group of chess enthusiasts checked into a hotel and they were standing in the lobby discussing their recent tournament victories. After about an hour, the manager came out of the office and asked them to disperse. But why they asked as they moved off? Because, he said, I can't stand chestnuts. Boring in an open for you. Ah, I God. pissed my pants. That's like the worst joke ever. One. A woman has twins and gives them up for adoption. One goes to a family in Egypt and called is named Amal. The other goes to a family in Spain to name him Juan. Years later, Juan sends a picture of himself to his birth mother. Upon receiving the picture, she tells her husband that she wishes she also had a picture of Amal. Her husband reply responds to twins. If you've seen Juan, you've seen them all. <laughs> Oh my god. <gasps> Blasphemy! One. Mark McGandy, as you know, walked barefoot for most of the time, which produced an impressive set of calluses on his feet. He also ate very little, which made him rather frail. With his odd diet, he suffered bad breath. This made him. I know the answer! Super callous, fragile, mystic hex by halitosis. <laughs> 21. And the fucking last thank fuck. And finally there was a person who sent 20 different puns to his friends with hope that at least 10 of the puns would make them laugh. No pun intended. <laughs> well that wasn't funny at all. Dear sir, I find your humour very boring. Get yourself better jokes, sir. These are the worst jokes ever. And anyway guys, sorry for the lack of videos. Good. You know what it's been, there probably will be one sooner or later. Maybe I've Another one up with Dave, maybe no, I don't know. You're lying. But anyway guys, I have been Bowsy. No, you have not. Like, subscribe, comment, you know the rest, and do the best. These jokes have been the worst things since fucking... Your birth. Sliced bread and... Do you